All right, everyone, I'll be heading off to James. I'll be right back. Oh, great, looks like I have another stupid customer. What do you want from me? My family would like to have classic cheeseburgers and spicy onion rings, and for drink, we would all like a Sprite. Okay, your stupid order will be here for 45 minutes. Please wait. After 45 minutes. Here's your stupid food. Now leave me alone so I can serve my other customers. That's very rude. Let me see if my order is correct in case if she has forgotten something. Wait just a minute. She ordered the wrong onion rings. I want a spicy one, not a classic one. Excuse me, ma'am, but I've asked for spicy onion rings. But you give me a classic one. I'm sorry, but we ran out of spicy onion rings. You must be lying, are you? No, I'm not. Just take a look for yourself. So, all this time, the spicy onion rings are sold out. Yep. Why didn't you tell me that before? Because I thought that was the one you wanted. You know what? Forget it. There's no point wasting my time arguing with you. So I'll just go. Man, that wasn't the first time I had to witness a customer at Jane's. And she was rude as well. At least I got my food now. When he arrives home. Hey guys, I'm back. Hey Billy too. I'm so happy that you're back. And you bought the food too, which was great. Well, it didn't went go well today. Why? I had to deal with a rude cashier at Jane's. When I was asking her for a spicy onion rings, she gave me a classic onion rings instead. When I looked at the TV screen, I realized that this restaurant had run out of spicy onion rings. So I had to bring home with classic onion rings instead. Gee, that's horrible. I'm sorry you had to deal with a rude cashier at Jane's. It's all right. I'm fine now. Hopefully, tomorrow, she will get her act right. On Friday. All right. Everyone, I will go to Jane's to bring home for dinner. You better give me my spicy chicken wings right now. I'm sorry, but we ran out of them. No, they're not. I still see them on the menu. How can it be sold out when they still have it on the menu? But I thought that's the chicken wings you wanted. Yes, I said chicken wings. But that's not the chicken wings I ordered. Well, you have no choice but to have the barbecue chicken wings. Besides, I hate spicy chicken wings anyway. But it's not about what you want, it's about what I want. Too freaking bad, you're gonna have to take them, and that's that. Now get out of here before I tell my manager. And what's your manager is gonna say? I'm going to tell him that you tried to beat me up. What the heck, why would you say that? I didn't even lay a finger on you. You are just gonna tell him that you are making up lies about me. Oh yes, I will. I will tell him if you don't get out of my sight. Fine. I am not coming back to this restaurant until you get fired. You don't deserve to be hired as a cashier. Screw you. And screw you too. Oh, it's you again. What do you want to order? Actually, I'm not here to order. I just saw you how you're talking to one of my best friends like that. That wasn't very nice, you know. I don't give a crap. Your best friend should have stuck to the one I gave him. I know that, but it is not okay of you to talk to Jonathan one like that. And he's right, you don't deserve to work here as a cash register. Well, that's too bad. I'm going to be a cash register for the rest of my life, and that's final. Oh no, you don't. You are not going to be a cashier for any longer. Instead, I will go to the manager's office and tell him that you are going to be fired for the way you talk to your customer. No, please, I'm sorry. It's too late to say sorry now. Charlie 2. Billy 2. I didn't know you were working here as a manager at Jane's. I know, right. I can't believe I am happy to see you. So are you. But enough of the talking. So anyway, what brings you here in my office today? While I was about to go inside and bring the food for dinner, your cashier was rude to one of my friends and made the customer leave because she claimed that the spicy chicken wings are sold out when in fact that the restaurant still have it in stock. Wow, I can't believe I mistakenly hired a cashier who was being rude. Thanks for letting me know about this. I will fire her as soon as possible. You're welcome. 
Jane, a customer who is my brother, told me you were rude to a customer and made one of them leave. Is this true? Yes. You are hereby fired to be as a cashier. Now go home now. So anyway, what brings you in here today? Are you here to get your food? Yes, I was. Alright, you can go ahead and tell me what you want to order. 